Hi, I'm just filming a quick video to show you all of the things that we've got ready to decorate for Lois's party on Sunday. Uh, you'll have to bear with me because it is Friday. I'm decorating the venue tonight and somebody small is right here playing because she doesn't feel like a nap so hopefully she won't be too noisy but um, I'll just crack on and show you the different things we have to decorate for Louise's first birthday party. Um, these are some great big pom-poms as you can see. We actually bought these in Crete on holiday which I know is ridiculous but they were really cheap and I love the colour and I just thought why not. They are supposed to be 40 centimetres in diameter, so Aww. about this size, I think. We'll see anyway. Okay, so from Tiger, I have another one of those hanging up y things. This one is a cupcake, and sorry, she's not helping. Uh, some polka dot popcorn boxes. and some straws, pink with hearts on and gold stripes. I also got these uh, sort of costume props, you know, for a photo booth. Um, we're gonna do like a sort of mini DIY photo booth type thing at her party. I thought it would be a fun activity for everyone and um, yeah, so I just got a couple of little bits for that. And these are more hang up things. Um, these are just princess paper fan pink ones um, and they were from Home Bargains and another cupcake from Tiger this one is a different colour pink and red when I was in Paper Chase I bought this very sweet little birthday rosette it's got a panda and when you shake it up there's lots of little stars and she's just adorable and Louisa loves pandas. The last things I got from Tiger were just two packs of purple and pink doilies. I thought these would be nice just spread out on tables or for obviously putting food on top of or just generally like add a little bit of cute decor so that's why I bought these. I probably have far too much stuff but I don't know I'm just really over excited about this party. Um, this is a star garland from Tesco this was in the sale so this was like literally like 25p or something so they probably don't have it anymore because I got it a few weeks ago but they'll have similar stuff anyway most of the stuff in this huge box beside me was very kindly sent to us by House of Party um, I will put a link to their website in the description box and within the blog post so you can go and check out all the stuff that they sell basically obviously they're a huge party supply company um they have hello they have tons of stuff for all kinds of birthdays and other occasions so i really recommend that you look at them um you can also get their things via amazon so just if you want to but anyway i'll show you the lovely things that they very kindly sent us to help us celebrate louise's first birthday we'll start with tableware these Gorgeous plates with little roses and polka dots and they're lovely. These come in a pack of eight. Um, I'll have the also have the links to like each individual product in case you want to go and buy exactly what we have. And to match, we'll have these paper cups. Again, lovely roses. And as if that wasn't enough cuteness, we have this lovely cupcake stand. It's pink and blue and there's lovely flowers and it's going to be very cute. Although, oh no, I, yes I am going to have cupcakes so that's what I'll use it for. We also have these little miniature napkins. I suppose they're cocktail napkins really aren't they? But they match in the set so lovely. And little to go into cute buns or other little sweet treats. I'll have to keep this away from Louisa, mind you, because obviously she'll eat the stick and not the bun. And as if we didn't have enough 
to hang up and decorate this venue with. We also have these, this big, huge, hmm, what is it? String decoration, it says. Okay, so 42 feet of decorating. There's six strips um, and they're seven foot long each. So, you know, it's just like first, little love hearts, little birthday things. You can actually see them better here. But what I'm gonna do with these is probably hang them like quite densely together, both packs, um, to make a backdrop for the photo booth I was talking about. So I'll just make like a cute area for people to go and take pictures and hopefully everyone will get behind that and I won't just be like a vacant corner. So that would be a bit awkward. And we also have some lovely bunting. Um, you can see it's pink polka dot, but there's also blue ones in there. And there's 14 flags, so it's three and a half meters long. And the last thing from House of Party is, of course, a great big number one balloon. You can't have a first birthday without a big balloon. So thank you very, very much to everyone at House of Party who sent Louisa these lovely things. Um, and please come and have a look at my blog um, later next week because I'll have loads of photos up from Louisa's birthday party and I'll probably do a bit of vlogging when I'm there as well so you can kind of see how we're going to pull all the de decor together because at the minute it looks extremely pink but the venue that we're using is um, an art gallery um, so it's like a really blank space um, so we needed quite a lot of things to sort of jazz it up and we're also using like quite a few sort of what's the word like heirloom things I guess um like crockery and plates and stuff from my mom and auntie and my grandparents house so it's kind of all going to be broken up and spread around um on different tables and things in this gallery so it won't be such a like pink explosion because <coughs> that's not really my thing anyway so I'm sure it'll all come together and it'll look really great but right now I need to go because I have to pack all this stuff up go and decorate the venue tonight and then tomorrow I need to get all the balloons filled with helium get a party dress for Louisa who still doesn't have a party dress I've just been spoiled for choice like I keep going into all these different shops and I never uh, I can never decide because there's just too many cool ones to choose from so I have to do that tomorrow the party's on Sunday I'm baking the cake probably gonna have a nervous breakdown but wish me luck <laughs>